Alright guys, so this will be the second part of the Season 2 video, so yeah, I'll explain some of the other stuff that I didn't explain last video, I suppose. Like, so first of all, uh, it turns out the, um, the new season isn't out yet, so even though it's already the 18th of July, I don't know why it's not out yet, I guess it's, I guess we have to wait a bit longer, I suppose. Also, so the magic gear changed, so it, it's got a new sort of, like, look to it, although... All the percentages and everything's still the same, so that's that's still a thing. Also, ranked mode got a new, like a huge redo. So first of all, you see how the logo was changed, so that's pretty cool. And also in here, on it's it's like changed like the entire backdrop and everything. And also, so I I did it on stream this morning, but basically what happened was I w used to be in um genius, and uh, so I went down two levels. I'm pretty sure. And, um, so the seasonal rewards are, if you're in Centurion, then you get a permanent, what is this, S2 Centurion title, or just, it was an S1 Centurion title, last thing, and then you get all these, you get a bunch of K coins and 20 battery coupons for all these other tiers. So, as soon as you get to, um, Legend, you get 20 battery coupons. So, like, you get 20, 20 battery coupons, so what 20 battery coupons do is, they give you 20, 20 batteries of any battery purchase. So yeah, that's, I guess if you spend batteries then I, I suppose that's useful, but you can't use more than one per purchase though. So that doesn't really help that much. It's not like, it's not like it's got the value of like 400 batteries. It's literally just, if you were to buy one thing, you can use the coupon to get 20 off it, but you couldn't buy things specifically just with it. Also, um, I don't know how it would work if, um, you say try to buy something with 20 batteries. Let's try that, let's try that. Less than 20 batteries. Let's see if there's anything here. Say this. If I wanted to buy this, it would cost zero. So I could... So technically, if the, the item costs less than 20 batteries, you can buy it using the battery coupon, which is actually really good. So you can finally, if you're a free-to-play player, you can finally get things that cost batteries, which is actually pretty epic. Although, there's not really a lot of things that you can get. I mean, you can get a Chromatic Crystal, Bazzi's Gift Box, Orange Lucky Box, Chroma Spray, Milk, and, like, a few decals. Like, no, not, not even decals. You can get a Club Challenge. So, I mean, technically, you you can, but I don't know. It's, it's only 20, so I don't know. I guess you could buy some things with it. Also, they added a bunch of new characters, including Lunarius who has some pretty interesting... But although she's only an epic though, she's only an epic, so if you have Kitty Diz or Tiger Dao or any of them, she's basically outclassed. But I mean, you get more baseline power, which is actually like, it actually gives you benefits during, um, during races, but it's, it's very, very minor. 1.2 is like literally nothing, so... I guess if you like the look of her, I'm sure, I guess, so that's the only new racer. Alright, so here, there's a thing called Solaris Code, which is, I don't know what, I'm not completely sure what it is. So, um, wait, why does it say no available coupons? Why can't I use my coupon? Okay, so it turns out you can't use the coupons in Chrono Shop, so that's also a thing. Also, so, I will buy this to see what is in the code. Let's buy it. Okay, I'm spending batteries. Use now. So, Solaris Codes. Um, let's have a look. So, you... What is in the codes? You can get permanent um, sword on your back or whatever it is. You can get Solaris or whatever. How do you how do you pronounce? And all the other cool items, I suppose. So why don't we try it? Let's do one of the races that allow you to open it, and let's go. So all it is. So Solaris codes. You need to do up and down village. There we go. All right. Now let's open it. I have just completed the up and down village. So let's see what is in it and open let's go free open what is in it oh, i got one chroma spray what did i even expect really what did i expect i guess like yeah i like why i <laughs> right, so there's also a new badge called s2 sword master which is reach legend tier in s2 which actually isn't too hard to obtain considering if you already start in say like master's division or like something like that it's actually not that hard to get um, into Legend, and 
it's a five star legendary badge, so that's pretty cool. Why don't we try out one of the new story mode levels? Let's do 21 1. What is this? So, Dow interrupts Dazzy's nap to invite him to a party. No. One, two, miss a good time. The groggy racer buckles up and hits the road. Let's go. So, this is one of the warp gates ones. Okay, let's do that. Alright, let's go. So, we get to use Xeno. That's pretty epic. Ep epic. Let's go. Alright. Three. Two, one, and go. Also, guys, just to let you know, oh my god, actually, Xeno has a very interesting feel to it. I haven't really, I haven't actually used Xeno before, so I'm not sure. But it, I actually really like the feel of Xeno. And also, if you haven't already gotten Xeno, um, if you, at this very moment, are at around 50,000 K coins, don't buy anything else with it. You should be able to save up to Xeno by the end of the season. It shouldn't be too bad to get Xeno. Xeno is actually like, Getting K coins is actually easier than I expected, and I regret wasting 13,000 K coins getting solar when I probably could have saved up to get Xeno, which is really, really sad. Because at that time, I was like, yeah, there's no way I'll get Xeno. It's just, it's too far fetched, and I just spent it on solar because I didn't have another cut at that moment. But then I ended up getting the Golden Lodi, um, what was it, Kafka, and then I, like, didn't use solar, like, ever. And I still. I think I still may be able to save up to Xeno, although I'm not completely sure. I've only got around 45,000 K coins, and I think you need around 60,000 to get Xeno at, if you're lucky. And if you're unlucky, then it might even go up to around 75,000 K coins. So, you know, who knows? You know, so if you've, if you've watched my, um, I'll, I'll link my video about how to get K coins quickly in the top right. So if you want to learn how to get K coins quickly to purchase Xeno, you know. You know, it's always there. Also, guys, be sure to leave a like and subscribe, because, you know, I, I, I want to get to a thousand so I can get some cash flow, man. Let's go through all the warp gates. Also, this is a really easy um, story mode level. I mean, the thing is, the thing with story mode is that I feel like it, it sometimes it just feels like a nuisance to do story mode, because there, there is no story to it. The, the, the story doesn't exist, right? And also, it likes, the levels are very, very repetitive sometimes. But I guess it's the same with most things in this game, so I suppose it's not the worst. But I, I feel like they could have improved the story at least. Oh, oh, I hit the wall. There we go. And with ease. Also, guys, if you haven't already watched part one of my season two, you know, video, you should totally watch it. I'll leave it in the top right or in the end card or something like that. And I hope to see you in the next video. Goodbye.